Hi guys, it's Boa and today I'm going to show you what I do in the range to practice my Valorant aim. Bear in mind, I am only gold 3, I am not a mortal. Um, on with the video! <laughs> Okay, so the first tip, we must get in the range. When I'm getting warmed up, the first thing I go to do is I select brimstone because there's something that we want to do while we're just in the practice mode. So once we're in the practice mode, all we want to do is get his brim alt out and we want to hover all the bots except for one. So while we're ulting him, we're going to change agents. You want them to the bots to get destroyed a little bit before you change agents, but just do what I do, okay? F2 to change agents. And when you load back in, there should only be one bot in the practice range. Okay, so what I like to do, which is a tip I discovered on TikTok, is I do a little wall here. And this kind of practices like my I don't know what the proper term is, but like counter shaping or like just being able to peek and, and kill a bot, so, or whatever, so like peek and, and do the thing, you know, so, uh, <laughs> so I do this for about five minutes, so just to get a little bit, turn, turn the brain on, <laughs> you get the point, so basically, I do that for about five minutes, I will do it with a sheriff, I'll do it with a, a phantom, I'll kind of just warm up with any gun that I intend to be using when I play comp. Um, just bear in mind, I'm not immortal. I'm literally gold. I'm nothing special. I will make sure my settings are right. So I usually go eliminate 100, bot armor off, infinite ammo on. Um, and then I would try and do 100 bots. I usually start with a sheriff, then I move to a vandal and then a phantom. And I do that circuit twice so by the end i've killed 600 bots and one tip that i found works for me is that when you're starting they can spawn all the way in your peripheral vision you don't even see them usually when in valorant you're going around a corner they're gonna be in your line of sight right they're rarely gonna be over here so instead of having to do this do this do this do this i hate that it doesn't to me that like when i have to move my mouse a bunch it's just not helpful. So what I do is I get in this corner just over here because the bots will spawn like some of them do spawn here. So I get behind this and I just start practicing. <laughs> the really far ones are a bit tricky, but um, this is a lot easier because it's all in your vision, in your line of sight. And I find this works for me. I'll get my vandal out and shoot that eventually. Oh. Then I'll just get into the little corner, sneak it back, <laughs> and I'm where I need to be. Then that's my whole routine. So it is practice range for five minutes behind Sage's wall, 100 bots with Sheriff, Phantom, and Vandal, and repeat that twice. So once I've killed 600 bots with the Sheriff, Phantom, and Vandal, I will usually hop into a deathmatch. So I'll do one deathmatch with Sheriff only, and then one deathmatch with the Vandal. And then by then I'm feeling pretty warm. At this point I'm on like day five, so. <laughs> but I've already seen a little bit of improvement, so. Give it a go, see what happens, I guess. Like I said, not gonna change your life. I'm not a model, but I have gotten tips from people on TikTok that are higher elo than me. So let's see if this helps me eventually hit plat or even diamond. Anyway, have a great day, stay hydrated. See you guys in the next video.